What's up guys, Anbuf here, back again with another video. And to be very honest with you guys, I've been an Android fanboy since its very inception. And while Android phones in 2017 are already pretty badass, here are a couple of things that you can do to make your experience all the more amazing. On that note, in today's video, we'll be checking out six mods or enhancements that you can apply to your Android device to make it even more badass. With that being said, if you guys like the video, leave a like, subscribe to the channel, and well, let's get started. You me, I feel the taste of your lipstick, even the bread of your Okay, so nobody likes making grammar mistakes, especially in 2017, where you have a guy ready to comment down your grammar errors in the next comment. Well, this application called Grammar Pal, once you install it on your Android device, simply turn it on and whenever there is a place where you can input text, it automatically scans it and then you can click on this refresh icon to see the number of errors that you have made and quickly, you know, correct them with the click of a button. A very handy application. If you guys like it, app link is in the description, do check it out. Alright, so if you're into photography or videography or anything of that sort, then the terms golden hour, long exposures, time lapses and all these cool things do mean something to you. Well, if you are that guy, then this application called DSLR Tools will help you greatly boost your photography or videography game. It gives you a list of all the golden hour timings in the place which you're staying at. You can even use it as a IR remote to shoot time lapses directly from your phone using your IR blaster and not having to use a remote and all in all it's just a must-have application for all of you guys who want to get into photography do check it out so the next mod is the one that has been teased in the thumbnail and most of you guys already know about it this is corner fly and essentially what this application does is makes the edges of your phone's display curved or rounded like the Samsung Galaxy S8 the LG G6 and the other flagships to come here in 2017 and I've got to say it, I was a bit skeptical before trying it out, but once I did, it's really, really cool. And it just changes the look of your Android device through a wide meter. You can just try it out and it's very aesthetically pleasing. Link in the description. Don't you guys just hate it when you're watching a video at night or doing something, you try to adjust your volume, but instead you adjust the ringer or the call volume instead. Well, volume notification is here to your rescue. Once you turn this app on, on your notification bar, you get the three volume controls directly at the purpose of a tap so you can just tap it and change the volume of your media your call volume as well as your alarm volume and having this directly at the point of my fingertips at the status bar is an absolute rescue for me so do check it out link will be in the description below android automation is a real thing and this application called conscient makes it all the more easier whether you want to plug in your headphone and open your media app of choice as i just did or do anything else using this application it's very much possible so essentially how this application works is that you need to create a fence for example i've created one here that is headphones plugged and it opens up YouTube. So once you click on the plus button, you can select a context where you can select a random activity such as walking, running, jogging, or plugging in a device to your phone. And then you can select the action that's going to happen once the context activates on your phone. Pretty cool app. Do check it out. We all know how to take screenshots, but sometimes we just want to share something we see on social media to our friends or anyone we're close to. And we don't want to have the hassle of saving a copy of that in our gallery. Well, well, Snippet is here to your rescue. Just with one tap, you can save anything that's on your screen, crop it before sharing it. And once you do that and hit on the crop icon, it gets saved to your gallery and you can either directly save it or share it to somebody. And once you're done, just drag this scissor icon to the bottom of your screen like Facebook Messenger and it's gonna disappear. There we go, another handy mod slash app, do check it out. And that is pretty much it guys. If you guys like the video, you know what to do, leave a like, subscribe to the channel. Also another important announcement, we're gonna have another Q&A, you know what to do, drop down your questions with the hashtag AskTAG, the video should be up in about a week or so. With that being said, this is the Android Guru signing out, you guys have a great day, I'll catch you guys next time. I'm gonna die, I'm gonna die, I'm gonna die